What is happening, y'all? Cowboy here. Welcome back. And, man, I just got a hard lesson in running AFK. So, we were making our way back to camp, and I was just doing a cinematic view and all that. Just, you know, uploading videos, adding titles, descriptions, all that jazz. And, um, I got ambushed by the Lemoyne Raiders, and they beat my ass. All I'm, I'm just, you know, sitting there looking at the other screen, not even paying attention to Red Dead, and all I hear is like, you, you crossed us the last time, you some bitch. And I look over, and there are about eight people that have surrounded me. Like, I see the radar. There's eight little red dots on the radar. Um, Arthur has basically all of his health gone. I dead eye managed to take out six of them, and then one just shotguns me in the face. And Oof. Oof is the only way to describe what just happened, but we made it back to camp. A little worse for wear, but anyway, let's go see Dutch and get this next mission going. Good morning. You know something? There she is. You boys don't know your boy. Arthur. Arthur. Dutch, Dutch. Well, now, you sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. We're in some disease-ridden, swampy, Dixie-whistling shithole. <laughs> uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. Well, not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So? I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. Trelawney. I'm trying to remember who Trelawney is. Charles? I need you for some business in town. Come on. Okay. Is Trelawney the guy that... Okay, girl. I don't think that was the guy that, uh... Came up to me. I was at, uh, fishing, or if that was somebody else. Carrot. I don't know why I'm taking that, but whatever. <sighs> Horse carrot. Give the horse a carrot. I said give the horse a damn carrot. Yeah, there's a girl. Come on, Arthur. There we go. Okay, happy horse. Where are we going? Dutch wants us to have a talk with Trelawney about these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Okay. And you're deputies now. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Soon as we laid eyes on that fool of a sheriff who runs that town, I knew Dutch was gonna play him like a fiddle. On the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Interesting. Hiding in plain sight, Dutch calls it. <laughs> mm. So, spirits seem good. In the new camp, I mean. We got some space between us and that mess now. I ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. There's these bounty hunters, of course, but Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Yeah, but they don't know that. Of course. Trelawney. I've only met him a couple times, but he's... he's a strange one. Was Trelawney? Hmm. Maybe that's the business... business type he's dude. He's just a cockroach in fancy britches. Yeah, I think it might be. When he gets into nooks and crannies, the rest of us can't. We just need to find him before he scurries off again. I don't know why it sounds like we need me and Charles to intimidate him, though. My understanding, if it's the guy I'm thinking it is, the one that we rescued from the, uh, from the carriage, I mean, he's friends of ours, you know? 
Unless he's more of just like an acquaintance that'll sell money to the highest bidder. Or sell info to the highest bidder, I mean. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I think it's just up here. Whoa. Yeah, he said he was hanging out in some yeah. shithole caravan. Someone got here first. So it seems. Check the house. There's some blood here. That ain't good. You see anything there? Oh, come on. Let me search the end table. The end table is glowing, like it wants me to search it, but Charles is in the way. Oh. Nothing found. Really? Big struggle. Pretty recently, I'd say. I guess maybe, uh, 12 hours ago? But no body? Not yet. Mm. Look. Tracks. Come on. This food's barely touched. Looks like he left in a hurry. Common stock, this is the mine share. Come on, this is certified Before blank as the holder of blank ahead. shares inclusive of the above company subject to the provision. I was talking about some mine thing, I'm yeah. guessing he had a run in with the people who were actually ahead of that. How's your tracking these days? All right, I guess. Hmm. Well, lead the way then. Not the kind of place I'd expect to see Trelawney staying in. No? Normally scams himself into the best hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean after the bar fight, I swear, he talked the whole way and never actually said a damn thing. I thought you knew. That's his special talent. <laughs> They could be 20 miles away by now. We can track them that far if we need to. Depends on how much you want to find them. Yeah. I still... Sure about that. Hey, I can see more tracks this way. Whoa! What are you doing? Excuse me. Yeah. Have you seen him? <clears throat> we're, uh, we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. Ah, <laughs> uh, you seen a strange sort of feller? Sort of formal? Strange? Sure. Formal? Nah. He uses a cane. Looks a lot like this one. Yeah. All right, you two. Where the hell is he? You both better get out of here. Come in. You knocked off my hat. This all day. Tell me now, you son of a bitch. Okay, okay, for Christ's sake. They took him to a cabin over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left. Down the path there by Braithwaite Manor. All right. 
I should do it. Right off my hat. Oh, stop running. What are you doing? I'm trying to loot these fellows real fast. Come on, let's go. Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. What are you doing? After you, then. You okay? I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. Just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and, well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he talked, I'll goddamn find out what he said. Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. Learn that much. I mean, how much time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent, keeping fish on the line. saying random southern things to help with the silence. Let's get you out of here. Come on, boy. The thing is, after that sack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. Uh, so you're uh, alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry, they won't be for much longer. Look, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. What he told them. Let's get after those sons of bitches. They've gone into the cornfields. We need to flush them out. Over there, where the birds are. I only saw two.
Where are you? Dumped his gear. Look around. He can't have gone far. I should see this guy. Easy. I'm not. You see anything? Body for the other one. Where is this bastard? Keep looking, Arthur. He must be close. <laughs> Definitely gone through these cornfields. I mean, keep searching. He's around here somewhere. I must be must have piss poured eyesight as I'm getting older here because I am not seeing this the guy I only saw two initially I need to, to look at oh, what the hell he's mine let me take him and get out of here you have my friend he's not your friend I'll give you money be quiet. I don't know, no wonder I couldn't find him. It was a scripted event. He should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Oh, shit. Thank you. The gunshot. Ah! Shots are coming from that barn. Come on. Inside. Get after him. There he is. Take him out. Good. You should be the last of them. <sighs> All right. Let's go back for Trelawney. Up for rare rolling yeah. black rifle. Right. Yeah. Never Actually, goes easy, does it? Rare. Sure it don't. Come on. Let's go see how badly they beat up the slippery feller. Rare I wonder rolling how much black. trouble he's brought with him. Uh, <laughs> guess we'll soon find out. Wonder if this is better than Seems the regular like we rolling can't block? Catch a break now, Arthur. Our luck's held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so I heard. <laughs> Sure. What's government agents and bounty hunters to us? Ah, uh, I hope you're right. Ella. Brush you off. You're looking pretty dirty after running through all that corn. Come on, girl. Mr. Trelawney, where are you? Over here, dear boy. Might you wait for me? You okay? Never finer. So, who was they? Uh, they were bounty hunters. Uh, attached to Cole Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What you tell them? Not much. I told them I was an intellectual. Come down here from Oregon, looking for a job at the university. Of course, they didn't believe me. 
seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. So I keep hearing. It might be best if I stay with you gentlemen for a while. Can't go back to that caravan now. All right, Charles. You take Trelawney back to camp. I'll catch up with you. Okay. Bounty hunters, Pinkertons, lawmen. Everywhere we go, there's more and more civilization. Perhaps this is it from now on. We shall see, I guess. for sport. Bounty hunters in the cornfield zone. Well, that sure as hell wasn't happen. While tracking, stay within 30 feet of his trail. That should have happened, but I ran off and I missed. Lose. Damn. What a mess. Well, while I'm here, let me see if I can pay off that bounty I have over in Valentine. Just bounties just pop up left and right in this damn game. Hello again. Good lord. It can't be worth it. It's like we got two missions to do back at camp, so y'all know where we're going from here. Question is, is it safe for me to auto run or will I, will I have some folks run up on me and shoot me like they did last time? Either way, I'll let y'all know. So stay tuned. Making our way to camp. Let's see. Let's see. Oh. Got a mission with Trelawney. Friends in very low places, and Micah. Eat Micah. I don't think I'll ever like Micah. I don't know, just something about him, you know? He just seems like a sleazeball of an individual. Sometimes you just get a feeling about certain people, and Micah, Micah just has that feeling, like he's gonna, I don't know, like he would sell his own baby, make a couple bucks to cover lunch. Like that kind of sleazeball. Anyway, wrapping up here, but I will catch y'all next time with more Red Dead.